All right, how's everyone doing? I'm Rich Cholenza. Thanks for checking out my channel. I'm, uh, I'm actually in Virginia, Regina, Saskatchewan in Canada. I'm at a Good Life Fitness uh, at the Golden Mile, they call it. And uh, one of the reasons I'm doing a video here is because a lot of times I like to show people different gyms that I go to throughout the country. And I've done one on Good Life Fitness before in Canada and Vancouver and Moncton, I think as well. So I thought I would do one here. They're kind of uh, really finicky regarding the videotaping inside their locations, but I'm gonna give it a shot. Uh, one thing I do wanna mention that I just recently found out is Good Life Fitness and 24 Hour Fitness teamed up, which is kind of cool for me. I'm thinking about maybe becoming a member there again because I'm only an LA Fitness member. But I used to be 24-Hour Fitness and LA Fitness, but when I moved back to Florida, there weren't any 24-Hour Fitnesses except for one really downtown. Now there's one closer, but now that I go to Canada a lot, Good Life Fitness is one of my favorite gyms. So for the money, it may definitely be worth it because I think between both of them, they gotta be at least at about 400 gyms. So anyways, let me take a quick three and get out of your way actually here. So this is what this gym looks like. These are nice gyms. This is the smaller one of the bunch, though, that I've ever been to. But I mentioned before what I what I really like about this place is their locker rooms are cool. They got huge lockers. I mean, deep and big. They also have an ironing board inside their locker rooms. Let's try to go this way so she doesn't bust my balls, maybe. So I'll go to the front here. So there's that. Eventually, I think they're going to tell me to shut the video off, but... Yeah, you can't beat Good Life Fitness. I really like this gym, and it's 24 hours, just like 24-hour fitness. So, kind of swoop this this way. There's the group fitness. Let's see. I have to kind of... Yeah, they always have that cycling room over there. Let's go this way. Try and avoid everybody, but you get an idea what it looks like. Like I said, it's probably the smallest one I've ever been to. But they're clean, they're spotless. And the people are usually very nice here. I don't need to go on and on. I've done other videos on Good Life Fitness, but yeah, they're definitely um, a nice gym. They do the, here's their CrossFit, I guess. That's what they call it, section. I'm not into CrossFit. More into weightlifting. So there you go, the Regina uh, Good Life Fitness. I'm going to wrap it up there. If you get a chance, uh, subscribe to my channel. I'm always going to be posting unique places I go to all over North America. Hopefully very soon in the future, Italy as well. Uh, I got a podcast out called The Rich Salenza Show. WTF are you talking about? I just have a YouTube page, uh, LinkedIn and Twitter as well. And uh, like I said regarding this gym, think about it. If you do some traveling, I don't think a lot of people knew that. When I went to go research it, again, 24-Hour Fitness now is... Um, with Good Life Fitness, which there's a lot of those gyms. All right, take care, and if you're traveling, safe travels. All right, how's everyone doing? I'm Rich Cholenza. I'm actually in Regina, or Regina, uh, Saskatchewan, at the Golden Mile um, Good Life Fitness. I actually reversed this. I sh first shot the video inside, and now I'm going to shoot, show you what it looks like on the outside. Usually. I do it the other way around, but it is so cold. It's uh, towards the end of January. We're having record breaker, uh, record breaking uh, temperatures all over. But still, I'm going to come out here and shoot it. So, like I said, I already shot inside. So I said a bunch of information about Good Life Fitness inside there. But this is what it looks like. This is one of the smaller ones I've ever been in. Um, doesn't have a pool or anything like that. I don't. I'm trying to remember. Do any of the good life fitness as I go to have pools I think some do um, but yeah if you get a chance if you're ever in Canada this is the gym or franchise you want to kind of join uh, or visit it's $15 for a day pass and uh, they just partnered up with 24 hour fitness which is kind of cool so if you are a member 24 hour fitness in the United States you're a member here as well but yeah I already talked about this stuff inside I am going to actually go grab a juice because I'm thirsty but this place is freezing all right Take care and...